opening a calendar that has been shared by someone else to you is actually fairly simple. Now, I am sitting here with the uh, account that was shared with from a previous exercise. And I'm going to select calendar and my personal calendar opens. Now across the ribbon, this is what we did before. We shared it. This is the account we shared it to. So now we're going to open a calendar and it says open a shared calendar. Now what account shared it to us? Well, the student account did. Now, unfortunately, this is a fairly long address. And now we see student one's calendar and our own calendar. And notice over here in our navigation, we can turn that off or turn it on as required. 